Um, so today we're going, it's a Saturday, and we're gonna go to, I think, the Melbourne Food and Wine Festival, I think? I don't know, somewhere. So, I guess, let's go! Here we go! So nice! Melbourne Convention Center. So we're inside. It smells like just food. Everywhere you go, everywhere you look, it's all food. Okay, so basically, this is like, this place is actually huge. We're only on one side of it. We came in from, where did we come in from? We came in from here. And we have to go all the way here. Or like set around the place. So we're in like a cheese aisle sort of thing. There's just cheese like places everywhere. And all over the floor are toothpicks. I'm trying the cheese. <laughs> And there's just so many people everywhere. Invaded personal space. But we're at the Adriana Zumbo store. And Adriana Zumbo is here. Which is pretty cool. But yeah, the macarons are amazing. They're to die for. Oh. So now we're on the other side. I've lost my whole family, but whatever. Um, and I don't actually know what that is. Some sort of not like it's like yeah, some sort of stage. Um, yeah, so we're on. Um, we're over there before, um, and when we came in, we we're down that side. It's crazy. I want to see what it would look like before they actually put all of this together. That would be cool. This is so awesome. It's called the Thankful Tree. So what are you thankful? What are you thankful for today? Thankful for food. I'm thankful for food. Food's awesome. Food is awesome. The music's so intense. There's someone down there and I don't know who he is. But South Australia, this year, four episodes Moran. of Western Australia. So I think we're finally leaving. But I don't know the place we're at. Wow, that was really zoomed in. But we're like over. I don't know. On the side. And I think we're gonna go for lunch maybe. But apparently everyone else is full because they had so much salmon. But I didn't. So we're finally outside and there's actually, look, there's actually room to breathe, there's room to move around, we're not like hitting people inside. So we just exited the exhibition center and we're, I think we're going to go down to Swanson Street, which is going to be fun. And yeah, I think we might go shopping for a little bit, grab some lunch, and then just hang out and relax. It's the weekend, so yeah. Okay, here we are. Yeah, we're at Southern Cross. And we're gonna go down to Melbourne Central and then to the Emporium. If anyone's wondering, this is what the inside of Southern Cross looks like. Looks pretty cool. Here at Melbourne Central. And we're gonna go up. Do you guys use these to clean your feet? Because I do that sometimes. It does actually help, sort of, sometimes. <laughs> I think they finally finished shopping, but then they're not sitting outside. <laughs> okay, so we've come back to the 
upstairs to the food court and we're here. So I'm at this fur place. Um, it's just in the food court and they told me to give them my name so I gave usually I use a random one but I gave them my name and he actually spelled it sort of right. Well this double two N's but I don't know. It's better than M A R Y. So that's good. It came and it actually looks really good. This is a small and it's this is my hand. This comparison's not very good, but I don't know. This is my hand. And it looks so good. And it smells really good as well. And I am done. Oh, I get it now. That makes sense. Okay. If there's no one in front of you, then you can fine. Like, you know what I realized? Even just up a bit. This is what I realized. How do you how do you film? People, I realized people are giving me these really, really weird looks. Like they're always staring at me. So then I was like, hmm, if I put it like straight on, because I have a phone, people probably think that my camera is Okay, people probably think that taking a picture of them like straight on. So then I guess I'm trying to do it a bit higher so that people, people know that I'm not filming them. That works. But my arm hurts and I don't have much arm strength. We're walking out um, Backstreet Mall now and so this is what it looks like. And check that out. It's wicked! Oh yeah. You can hear someone busking. Oh look at him. Hear him play piano. Melbourne Central? Yeah. And now we're at Crown Menard, which is pretty cool. And there are like fires outside. Ooh, that looks awesome. Oh, we're back. Melbourne Exhibition Center. And we're back inside. It's actually nice and warm in here. I can't believe people are still here. They must have come later on. No, because this the last time you're passing through the crowds coming out of the doors. Last time we were in Korea, and since we walk on the left side in Australia, um, and then. Look at that guy. <laughs> Should I edit that out? What did you do? Extreme penis. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay. So we um We were walking on the other side of the road, which is right, and it was just so unnatural. It was weird. Even driving on the right side, we would always cross the road. When we crossed the road we would look right and then left. And we realized there were no cars. But then technically, since everyone was driving on the right side, it made no sense at all. Yeah, 